everybody, welcome to Franny Square and to another flash review where I review crochet products in less than 10 minutes. I had to change it. I have to make sure I get in all the information and I felt like I was running against the clock. So I'm making it 10 from now on. Stay tuned for this review. Okay, so the product that I will be reviewing today is this crochet hook set that I got in my crochet hook shopping spree. If you didn't see that video, I'll put a link right here. You can go check it out. I bought several sets of crochet hooks. I eliminated a few right from the start I didn't like. And the remaining sets, I've decided to go through systematically and use them for a period of time so that I can give you more information about the sets so that you can make more informed decisions when you're purchasing hooks. So this is the hook set that was least expensive in my shopping spree. I paid $7.64 for it, and it's selling now for $9.79. It comes with nine hooks ranging from two millimeter up to six millimeter, and it has the half sizes in between. So there's two, two and a half, three, three and a half, four, four and a half, five, five and a half, and six. You get nine hooks and you also get 10 stitch markers and three yarn needles, which are metal. And I like the metal ones, so that's great. So all in all, price-wise, you get a lot for your money. So let's talk about the hooks themselves. Aesthetically, they come in different colors, so you can tell your hooks apart just by the color. I like that. Uh, let me take them out and show you what they look like. They're a silicone handle. The size is printed on. You can see right there the size is printed on. This is the hook that I used mostly, and you can see it's already starting to smudge and wear. So I would say if you get these, put clear nail polish over top or mark them with something permanent or memorize the colors, keep a list, whatever works for you. I don't know that the size is going to last on this. This is only about a week, week and a half use. So they do come in different colors. I wouldn't say they're pretty. It's certainly not like a piece of jewelry like Ferl's was, but you know, I would say they're middle of the road aesthetically. As far as the grip goes, they're silicone handles, which are comfortable. I don't love the length of the handle. For me, it's a little bit long. I'll show you. Here's my clover. So you can see the difference there. And I like that this just fits right into my hand. This one hangs over and it, it can rub at times, depending on how you hold it. Uh, it just didn't do anything for me, the length of this. Also, it's flat. You can see it's not rounded on the back. I don't love that either as far as comfort goes, and that's personal preference. I mean, it was fine. It wasn't like I was hurting from using it. It just didn't feel as comfortable as, say, my Clover or the Edimo or even the Furls, which had that rounded piece. One thing to note about these is that the crochet hook itself, the metal, is full size and goes down into the silicone, which is nice. You don't have the problem of just the top popping out that's glued in, so that's nice. As far as slip goes, this had really good slip. I was surprised. Really, I would say comparable to even the clover. The only issue is I did have one hook out of nine that had a little... Uh, sharp metal part that kept catching onto my yarn. It was only one of the nine hooks and I don't know if that's an anomaly or if that happens often because I only did get the one set. So that was a little bit of a pain and I don't know if you can sand it off in some way and make it okay. But as I said, the other eight hooks, perfectly fine. As far as the point goes, see if you can see that, it's not quite the point we get on the clover. I didn't have any real issues with it. It's just not quite as good, I would say, but still good. Length of hook wise, if I compare to the clover, it's slightly longer than the clover. So 
I think the length of the hook itself is excellent. So for an overall rating for this set of hooks, for price, I give it a five. You get a lot for your money. And even if I had to get rid of that one hook that was snagging, eight hooks, 10 stitch markers, three yarn needles for $9.79, not a bad buy at all. For aesthetics, I give it a three. Middle of the road, nothing really great, nothing really bad. Grip wise, I give it a three. I didn't love how flat it was or how long it was. So middle of the road. And again, that's personal preference. For you, you may like a longer handle or a flatter handle, in which case it would get a higher score. Slip wise, I would give it a five, except that I did have that issue with that one hook. So I'm gonna give it a four. Had that one hook been like the other eight, it would have gotten a five for slip. For the point, I think the point is excellent, just not as excellent as the clover or the etimo. So I'm gonna give it a four on the point. And for length of hook, it's longer than my clover and I like a slightly longer hook. So I'm gonna give it a five on length of hook. So the overall rating for this set is 4.0 Franny Squares. And honestly, I think this is a great set if you wanted to use it as a stocking stuffer, if you wanted to give it to somebody who's just learning how to crochet and you're not sure they're gonna stick with it, or if you wanna have a travel set and just you know, not have to worry about your hooks if you should lose them or if you should give some away. I have to tell you, I was happily surprised by this set. Okay, I hope you found that review helpful. If you have any questions at all, please post them in the comments below or send me an email to my email address at frannysquare at gmail.com. If you've used these hooks, please share your experience with them as well in the comments below. It really does help the whole community to hear from different people. I use a knife hold and I have my certain preferences. So when you're putting your comments down below, if you can just state which kind of hold you use and what your experience was, that would be really great for our community. As always, thank you so much for joining me. I truly appreciate it. Remember to make it your own and I'll see you soon. Mm -hmm.